Papa's gonna hold the Levi down while he takes the shots. Hey, Papa, you doing okay? <laughs> you see it? Yeah. Look at those fish. Yeah. Oh, you want to do it? Yeah. Elijah, get footage. Yeah. Look at those fishies. What color are they? Purple. Purple. What else? Papa's gonna hold the Levi down while he takes the shots. Hey, Papa, you doing okay? Huh? Hey, are you doing okay, Papa? What are you learning there? You got your shapes in right? Oh, that, that one, Bubba. Boat goes that one. Guys, we just got out of the pediatrician's office and we ordered out some sushi because little Bubba was not feeling the shots today. He did pretty good for the most part. I mean, he was mad. Yeah, he was mad. Uh, there were no tears, he was just mad. <laughs> He's a tough boy. But, um, so we're heading back to the house, got us some sushi to go. So we're gonna go and enjoy some of that, show y'all what we ordered, and... All the tasty sushis is what we ordered. And we ordered some noodles for Eli, because he loves noodles, and I'm sure Levi will have a bunch of those also. So we'll see you guys there. Hey guys, we are finally home. Little man did good. You good? Yeah? And we're ready to eat. We are hungry. We got our sushi. Papa's getting it all laid out for us. Thank you, thank you. Yeah. Thank you for the food. All right. Let's see what we got. Elijah or Levi is hungry after his shots. Oh my gosh, Levi, which one do you want? We want the spoon. avocado here. Have a, we got avocado Chocolate. rolls for the boys because we're not quite sure if they can eat raw fish yet. I'm pretty sure Elijah can. Eli can, but we prefer not to feed this yet. So yeah. I got some seaweed salad. I love seaweed salad. Yeah. And we always opt for the clear soup instead of the miso. We like the clear soup better. And then you with a side salad with their homemade ginger sauce. What should we got? We got noodles for the boys. Yakisoba. Mm -hmm. So Papa's splitting yakisoba for the boys before they fight, they are hungry. And I also got some avocado rolls. Just some plain avocado rolls for Eli and Levi. Uh, let's see, Papa always orders his black pepper tuna yes. and his spicy scallop. Oh, yeah. Spicy crunchy scallop. We also got some seaweed salad. We like seaweed salad. And I always get salmon. I like salmon. I like tuna, but tasty. salmon's a lot. It's got a lot more flavor. Flavor it's, uh, uh, flavorful. I guess it's not as dry as the tuna. I guess different strokes for different folks. I mean, I have my moments where I just. It want just some melts tuna. in your mouth. It's like salmon yeah. just melts in your mouth. Tuna, it's a little bit um, firm. I guess it's more firmer meat. But that's what we got. So comment below what yeah, your favorite cool. sushi is. I know everyone kind of has their own. I didn't get any California rolls uh, mm. because we don't usually like California rolls. No, no, that's what you got. I did not. I'm sorry. Well, I'm gonna eat. I didn't want to order a bunch of food and have it left. So how's that? Seaweed. Is that what we're gonna talk about? Talk about seaweed. Mm, that's good. No. Let's see if little bubble likes seaweed salad. 
You want to try it? A bite? No. Elijah, will you Elijah, try a bite? Elijah, want to try seaweed? No. So adventurous. No. Yeah. Well, they're older. Ooh, it's got little eggs in there. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Caviar eggs? What is that? Or fish eggs. Fish eggs. Caviar is a little bigger. Mm. No. Look you. And mm -hmm. put one in a little bowl for them. Little sabi? Right here. Oh. But you know what I got myself wasabi. I love wasabi. Like, I like it burning through my nose, like through my nostrils kind of burn. Too much. Nostrils. That moment when you're like, I have had too much. That's what she likes. But it's good. It's like, it's like a clean feeling. I think it's like overdone. Getting. Like if you're eating spicy oh, food and you have way too much, like you don't get to taste or enjoy the food anymore. It's just the flame. It's kind of where she likes the wasabi. Like you don't taste the sushi anymore. It's just that antiseptic feel. Yeah. Like you enjoyed it's good. hand like wash it. or what is it? Hand sanitizer. Yeah. Put in the mouth. All the wasabi for the mama. All right, guys. I still will shines. you try ginger pickle? Nope. Try Who wants to do a wasabi challenge? No. <laughs> no. Mama likes a wasabi challenge. Mama Can we wasabi the baby? No. We're early in the film. We were bummed. We thought our sushi place closed down, mm. but fortunately, Sean's brother told us it did not close down. It, they just relocated. moved. Yeah, re relocated. Um, Is that a good noodle? Restaurant. So, I will help you eat a noodle. That one right there. <laughs> how is um, your How's your rolls? Papa. These uh, noodle rolls are delicious. Noodle rolls. <laughs> Mama's got her salmon. Mmm. Mmm. Mm. Where you got that salmon? I like that burn. You gonna try some of their ginger sauce for their so? salad? Mm. Aren't you glad I introduced you to sushi when we first ate it? Yeah, I wasn't so about it. Actually, <laughs> I was not at it at all, but I thought I'd at least give it a shot to say I did it. Yeah. Papa. Well, I think you were. Yeah, I think you were playing it safe and, yeah, and you got. Yeah, yeah, noodles. Sour noodles. Um. Yum. Mm. When we first went out, I guess maybe a couple, Papa, meow, meow, maybe Papa. third or fourth day, we asked if he wanted to go eat some sushi. Mm -hmm. And yeah, you're kind of like. Now two kids later, Sean devours the sushi. <laughs> Papa loves the sushi now. Sashimi and all. I first tried it, I didn't think too much of it. Like, you know, there I tried it, it's nothing special. But roughly two weeks later, your body craved it. I guess that's the natural proteins or whatever. And I was like, eh, well, let's, let's, let's go give it a shot. I want to try something else. I think I stayed uh, played safe with like shrimp that was already cooked, yeah. a little bit of rice, and some tuna. But after I had some salmon, I was a little eerie on it because it's orange. Like, why is it orange? That's the the fats and the muscle that goes into a, a regular salmon. It's quite delicious. It's a little more buttery than tuna is, um, even outside of being raw. Mm. Like being cooked is delicious. Being raw, mm. it's pretty good. Yeah. And Papa's actually a lot more adventurous than me now. Because he would eat the. What's it called? Uni? 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 The urchin? Yeah. The uni. The sea urchin. Yeah. We had ordered some. This is when. It's like leopard. A couple of years ago. It's kind of gamey. Um, yeah, he ordered uni. I did not care for it. I'm <laughs> sorry. It was still moving. <laughs> <I think laughs> but I mean, you need it fresh. I mean, you're, you're supposed to like is serve it, it pretty much. Then right there. there. Yeah. You have to consume it like right away. I didn't care for it. It was it was fishy. It, like You I, also waited. Maybe I waited too long. You I waited and then like after a after a minute it sort of melted mm -hmm. and that's whenever you tried it and I was like, I'm gonna eat it now. Mm. Oh wow. But that's a good rule of thumb with most things in life. If it's fishy, don't eat it. I'm sorry, I don't know if I actually swallowed it or if I spit it out. I don't remember. I don't remember either, but it was uh, like that kind of ruined it for me. I'm this doesn't smell fishy. No. <laughs> Fresh sushi won't have a fishy smell to it. That's some good tea. I thought it was soup at first. <laughs> you guys want an <coughs> avocado roll? No, 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 no,
Ruby BBB. I'll have it then. Can you get her sushi stuff? Hmm? Yeah, we, I mean, we've been to a couple of different types of sushi. And the one with the, the beef on it, and they did like a little sprinkle of cheese. Oh, and I yeah. thought that was. I really don't care for Americanized sushi. That seems to be a, a phase with most every restaurant now. You have places like Chili's, and I know I'm probably shooting myself in the foot, but places like Chili's that are going to do Southwestern egg rolls. Now, don't get me wrong, they're delicious, but we're trying to merge so many different foods. So then you have something that's uh, Japanese, and then they'll come back and they're going to do jalapeno, cream cheese, crawfish, and then they're going to fry it. Whenever you fry sushi, it just tastes like you don't taste anything. It kills the flavor and you just taste fried rice. And we don't, yeah. yeah. It's, it, it's whatever. However, this is also coming from somebody who doesn't want bacon on everything. I know it's a cardinal sin. We're going to have bacon so many good. unsubscribes right now. I like, we don't bacon. like bacon. Bacon doesn't go on everything. <laughs> I, this is coming from a person who's also had um, bacon on a Sunday. You can crumble up and have fresh crispy bacon on a Sunday. It's not bad. But bacon lettuce, bacon lettuce apple pie. <laughs> it's worth a shot. I'm on. I'd give it a shot. I just think that maybe the U.S. has an unhealthy relationship with bacon. <laughs> it doesn't need to be for breakfast all the time. Sometimes. Is there a beef alternative mm. to bacon? Can I get like some beef strap? They gave us some miso too. But she gave it's okay. Me. I mean, I don't. She asked me if we wanted miso or Miso's clear. Good. I told her we wanted clear. She said, okay, hold on. <laughs> oh, she changed it. Mm -hmm. um, you good? Probably anyway, that's my what? little food rant. Yeah. I'm not the authority on food. I just know what I like. Just like everybody likes whatever. Recently, we went to go visit the family in California. Oh, that's some of the best sushi. Well, there was another one, like a couple, last year when we went to go visit and my friend Danny had, they took us to... Sugarfish. Sugarfish. Really awesome. Place. Really fresh sushi. I mean, seriously, it's like, it melts in your mouth type of sushi. It was a little expensive guy, but I think it was worth, it was worth every penny. Well worth it. Yeah. The, um, I do not like, we just talked about it, if it's fishy, don't eat it. Yeah. Um, whenever you're in Texas, we have not eaten all the sushi places, but if you go to get crab, especially soft, uh, soft shell crab, blue, it's blue, really blue fishy, crab. and it, it's a turn off for me completely. Like old tuna sandwich or something. You know, I'm not eating this. Well, <laughs> while we were there, uh, somebody had mentioned like, let's go ahead and get this. Or it came with a meal, but there was a hand roll. It was the blue tuna. Um, no, it was blue crab. Blue crab. Mm -hmm. uh, blue crab, and that was. I've, I've not had anything like that. That was the best thing ever. If I could go really back, good. I'd eat probably 16 of those. Those are awesome. If I could get some now, we have a P.O. box. <laughs> Ship it over overnight, please. Overnight, so we can get it on uh, dry ice, so it's nice and delicious by next morning. That would be great. I really appreciate it. It was really good. And it was just like simple. It didn't have all the extra sauce and we don't care for all yeah. the extra sauce because it overpowers the actual flavor of the sushi. Yeah, that's a lot of the... We um, prefer just plain rolls. American uh, sushi is... We're going to drench it, uh, drench it, drink, drench it. Okay. Yeah, I like drench it in like all these different sauces and stuff and... Jalapenos, way too much cream cheese. A little cream cheese goes well. Yeah, I can definitely see like the smoked salmon and cream cheese, and then just a regular cream cheese and uh, salmon. Mm -hmm. Then have to be smoked. It depends on what flavor you want to, what mood you're going into. This one will beat you in the eating. <coughs> Probably a mukbang with Levi here. Try again, son. He'll beat you. <sighs> Mama needs more wasabi. I would, I would beat anyone in wasabi eating mm -hmm. contest. Is that a thing? I don't know. <laughs> I'm still down for like, you know, this is this is green horseradish. It's just powder horseradish with a little green tint to it. Actual horseradish is expensive as all get out and will knock your socks off. Its antiseptic power is really, really strong. Oh, I still look. Should've gotten two seaweed. Two seaweed? Two seaweed salads. 
Yeah, probably probably not care for that little imitation crab. No. That's why we don't usually get California rolls, because it has imitation crab in them. I mean, over time I've kind of grown an appreciation for it, but it seems like the lack of consistency that I've had, which is scary because it's a mass-produced product. I like imitation crab. I mean, I guess I kind of, I, I wouldn't say grew up on it, but I mean, I had it when I was little. Mama would always put it in like their stir fry, we'll have our like bun noodles, and then we'd always put imitation crab in there. Mm. And so I kind of grew up, it up liking it. So it doesn't bother me. I'll just like seriously buy um, a package from Kroger and just snack on it. With the crab sticks? <laughs> With the crab sticks, yeah. yeah. So I hope you guys enjoyed our little sushi and little mini vlog that we did today. Um, Levi is definitely enjoying his food. I think he deserved this after his yeah. two shots that he got and he was a really good he was really good um, with the shots. would like to know your sushi comments. We're interested. I would like to learn more. Um, if you have any thoughts, comments, questions, concerns, let us know. Please give our video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it and subscribe if you haven't. Thanks for watching guys. Thank you so bye, much. Bye, 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 <laughs> bye, bye, you want some ginger? No. Not much ginger. I want a noodle.